Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 46, and this is war number seven. And looks like we're going up against an alliance, uh, UAPL. All right, let's see, who did they ban? Ghost, Scorpion, and Hercules, okay. Let's see what we got going on here. Okay, good. So I take path three, in case you guys didn't know. And so I'm looking here at Shuri and Vox. Vox gives me a little bit of a pause, but I don't think he's going to be a problem. Uh, he gets armor ups, so he benefits from the node. Um, Hulkling could do well there. So could Gallon. But Hulkling should also do well against uh, Shuri here. So I'm thinking Hulkling for this first path here. Okay, so we've got uh, future Ant-Man. That's Magneto. And now, hmm... We have Namor, and he is a mutant. He's also a uh, global defender. So I will most likely bring in uh, OG Iron Man for him. And then... Uh, whew. Wow. Okay. And then we'll see. We'll see what uh, our officer who does our uh, matchups comes up with. Hmm. Shock and bleed, huh? I almost want to bring in um, Onslaught for that. I really, ugh. But I mean, Onslaught could do if I brought Hulkling. Magneto and Onslaught. Uh, nah, I better stick with it and not stretch myself uh, too thin. So yeah, OG Iron Man, Magneto, Hulkling. All right, uh, unless something changes, that's the team I'm going in with. So let's get on with the fighting. On with the fighting. All right, let me tell you guys something. This war was a learning experience. But more on that later when we get there. So you see the team I'm going in here with, Magneto, OG Iron Man, and Hulkling. Now, OG Iron Man, if you remember some of my previous wars where I used him, he can block unblockable specials from mutants. So in this particular meta, I figure he's a good option for being able to deal with some of these uh, defenders. So first up, we've got Hulkling against Shuri. Shuri, don't even try to parry her, not gonna happen. However, Hulkling don't need that and he's immune to the shocks. So we can really just, you know, play her like you see right here. You know, we can take some hits, that's fine. Doesn't hurt. Look at that. Just shaved off about 30% of her health. Look at this. Hulkling is just a beast. Now she's untouchable, so we gotta wait. Gotta wait. All right, of course she's gonna fire that off. Just block it. No reason to, you know, be in danger by trying to evade it. Oh, now I'm unblockable. Fire the special off. And Shiri goes to sleep. Yes, Hulkling. 
And if you want to know, my Hulkling is rank five and is ascended. Hulkling is a beast. Now, this one, I was a little bit concerned about because I don't really fight Vox. So I'm not as familiar with his um, abilities and, and uh, animations. But I did remember that he does get armor ups. So I knew I wanted somebody in here. See, there's an armor up right there. So I knew I definitely wanted to get someone that was going to be immune to the shock, at least. So look at that. He's got five armor ups. And if I remember correctly, I think they're passive, so you can't armor break them. I'm not sure on that. Like I said, I'm not uh, that familiar with them. Now, what I, what I did there, normally I try to wait until I'm unblockable, then fire my special off, but you'll notice that I'm getting power lock often. Hulkling is not immune to power lock. So every time I'm hitting him, you know, when he has an armor up, but now, ooh, ooh, yep, there it is. His armor ups went away. But if he has armor ups and I hit him, I'm gonna get power locked for I think like six seconds, something like that. But that time, it was a happy, uh, what is it, congruence? Is that what you call it? Um, where his armors dropped off. I'm not even sure why they did, but I made the most of it. I was like, uh oh, I'm unblockable and I have my special and I'm not power locked. There you go. All right, now this fight is becoming pretty standard. Um, as long as they don't ban uh, Magneto, we will always bring Magneto in for this fight. Um, it just makes the fight pretty simple, okay? Now, uh, Magneto does have a high resistance to bleed, but if you play it right, you shouldn't have to worry about that. So you can see here, I'm backing off. I'm not fighting him right away. I'm waiting for the armor to go away. Once it goes away, we can just come in here, start doing our parry heavy. Now there I missed, but fortunately, Magneto is unstoppable. But look at that, see the, the bleed? I wasn't paying attention, I got mixed, or, mixed up, and I let him get those armor ups and I just went in. And I didn't notice that he has these armor ups. So you have to be careful about that. Now, if you have the um, Pacify Mastery maxed out, that's less likely to happen, okay? Um, but it's okay, we, we good. You know, just reset. And now I'm kind of watching for the, um, the armors to uh, come back. But I ain't giving him a chance. Ooh, lucky. Did you see what happened? Power detonation. Otherwise, I was about to hit him with a special three. I was like, oh, you are so lucky. So at this point, he's going down, unless I mess up really bad. Okay. And I'm like, you know what? I want to get that special three. So let's just hit him like this and go into this special three. I didn't really need to. He probably would have died to a special two. But... There's just something about that special three that I like. Because even if somehow he survives that, what happens after that with all the shrapnel, he ain't surviving that. All right, now we've got Namor. He's a mutant and he's a global defender. So this is perfect for OG Iron Man. Now, you'll notice that he doesn't get an armor up or anything like that, so he's not benefiting from this nose. But they know that this meta in war is crapola. So they want to line it as much as they can with these defenders, but we've got some counters, all right? So, and nothing stops me from trying to evade it still, okay? So I'm trying to, you know, bait this out. Come on, there you go. And see, I blocked a little bit of it and then evaded some of it. All right, yep, see? 
So I can I can block it. The problem with blocking it, even though I can, is that you still take a ton of block damage. It's what makes a lot of um, the alliances, you know, basically say, we're just not gonna, we're not healing up. Forget that. Because it seems like when Kabam created this meta, they designed it so that we would end up using a lot of resources. And I've used more resources, so I guess mission accomplished. Um, you know, it, you could you could fight perfectly as in you didn't get hit and still end up having to heal up. All right, now, here's some learning. Now, you'll notice my path, I did my path, I had my counters. Now we're going in, and this is me going in someone else is telling me you know this this might work you know now you know nothing against the the one who did this because he's also learning you know and you know this this particular he has to assign people even if you know no one has the best counter i had a good counter so it looked like you know, it's a mutant, global defender. So looks like Iron Man should be the, the, the thing, right? So you'll see what happens. But I'm I'm you know boosting up and everything. But this this fight I think shows exactly what I don't like about the meta. Now, I will say this, if you watch my later videos, you'll notice that I found a couple of secret weapons uh, that should work and probably would have worked better on this guy too. But anyway, so I'm gonna go in, you know, power back boost, you know, uh, power boost rather, and let's do it. Let's see what we can do, right? All right, so we go in, there we go, no problem. Look at the damage I'm taking from his block. Look at the damage I'm taking from the block. Okay, look at this. Don't know why that didn't work. All right, now watch this. That time I had to evade it. But look at, look at the damage into my block. Not to mention, of course, I was, you know, getting poisoned and all that good fun stuff. So I was just like, you know what? Maybe OG Iron Man ain't the one for this. Problem was, we didn't really have backup. So I'm like, okay. And you see, I'm looking over here because I'm like, what in the heck is going on? Okay, uh, the power sting. All right, all right. But I'm looking at it and I'm just like, how did I take all that damage? Did I fire it off and I didn't, um, you know, uh, 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 notice the power sting? But it is what it is. So now I've got to revive and I have to heal up. Because like I said, there's no backup. So I'm all by myself. Got to deal with this guy. Got to get him down. And I did ask, you know, after that, you know, first fight, I'm just like, okay, OG Iron Man don't look like he a good option for this fight. Give him feedback so that they know for the next time. Don't, don't, don't try that no more. You know, just not a good, uh, good counter. At least not on that node. Now, again, I could just keep evading it. And I'm sure someone who is, you know, very skilled can still do that fight. You know, but yeah. I don't want that fight no more. <laughs> i tell you that. See how expensive that was? Now, since then, I have started to just buy like one or two at a time to stock up. 
uh, so that it's not so expensive, you know. But I hadn't done that here yet. And I was not looking forward to this season after this. But like I said, I got better. I got some uh, good options and, and I learned a little bit better. And although Iron Man is good, because of a lot of that block damage, I've got a better option uh, for this meta. All right, so here you go. I'm in there and I'm taking health off. So I'm just like, all right. Now, here we go. That's a power sting. All right. Okay, blocking it. Look at the damage. Blocked all of that, but look at the damage I took. Okay, more power sting. Cool, cool. Okay, still trying to bait it out. You don't want to. Come on, come on. Let's go. Come on. There you go. Let's block it. Don't ask me why that happened. You see, I'm like blocking it, right? It's just block. Whatever. Cool. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Great. Beautiful. Now, the whole reason that I use Iron Man is because he can block unblockable specials from mutants. What's going on? Why, 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 why am I block? Just that sometimes he's not blocking. He's just standing there taking hits. All right, yeah, all right. But we're all good. Now I want you to notice something. I'm, I'm reviving, right? Just spent like over a hundred k loyalty. See what I'm doing now? Okay, I'm like, mm -hmm. and that's it. Because I'm definitely not using no units. Not doing it. So, here we go again. Lovely, lovely. All right, let's go in. Okay. Chipping him down a little bit more. Ooh, it's unblockable, which we expected. Come on. Throw it. There you go. Can we block? Just block? Yeah. Still took a ton of damage. But at least we could block it. Okay. There we go. Got some damage in. Look at it. Oh! Now that time, I tried to evade it and got rooted. Do you know what it feels like? It's like you go to move and find out that somebody has tied your shoes together. And you guys know how triggered I get with Root. And now they've made a whole meta where Root is a part of the global defense. Are they trying to make me quit? I don't know. But anyway, you see what I just did right there? I'm just like, we just gonna get him down. There's no point anymore. Look at it. Just block it. Take the damage. Keep going. Oh, he's got regen. Yeah, that's wonderful. Come on. Fire it off, fire it off. Yep, just block it. Mm-hmm. Still taking a lot of damage, but at least we're taking his health off. And then I tried to fire the special so I could get some damage in. Had a power sting. I'm just like, I at that one, I just laughed. Because that one was just my fault. But at least I had not used up a ton of um, health potions. Now, I'm just going in. Chip him down. I am not trying to do nothing else. Like I said, learning experience. So, ugly. But we'll get him down. He will go down. We won't have any um, attack bonus on it. Okay, just block. There you go. Hey, power sting. Be careful. Look, 12% health. There's the power sting. It's gone. There you go. Get him. 25% health. Let's just go in. We don't care. Hey, hey, he didn't fire it off. But of course, I can't fire the special. And if I tried to wait the power sting out, he was just going to fire that. And I didn't have time for that. So I did that one on purpose so we could just get this going. If that hadn't, If I hadn't done that, I would have just quit the fight. 
So anyway, I went down there just to see, do I have another one? Nah. Let's just keep on uh, reviving and just get this guy down. Ugly, 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 ugly. At least, at least I got my path done, right? What can I say? Um, but you know, the the, uh, the whole alliance is sympathetic with this meta. Let me tell you, nobody likes it. Nobody. All right, there we go. He got five percent. Woo! Lovely damage. He's got another one. Let's wait that uh, power sting out. Get him! Yeah! Oh, no! Now, I want you to know what happened right there. Do I need to tell you what happened? If you've ever had this happen to you, you already know. I hit my special, he fired his. You saw he had 1% left, right? So that was supposed to be a combo into a special, like I do all the time. You see, I didn't even bother trying to revive. I'm just like, man, just, just knock him out. I'm just sitting here going, wow. That was fun, wasn't it? This war, great stuff. But guess what? I can't take a rest because I got another fight. Now, you know I'm salty, right? But I'm like, okay. We got um, Scorpion. I don't know really too much about this fight. Same basic attack, increased damage. Okay, whatever. We're good. Um, I was told to use Magneto. So I'm like, okay. Now, I'm always worried about fighting a global defender because of the mess that is the meta. We don't really, we're not given any good counter. Our attacker tactic, not good. Um, if they really want us to have a decent attacker tactic, make the attackers that benefit from that attacker tactic immune to the Dauntless. But anyway, so I'm thinking, all right, this fight should be pretty straightforward. He's magnetized, all right. Parry heavy, cool, cool. Parry heavy, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Everything's looking good, all right. Parry, heavy, getting my prowess up. Uh-oh, yeah, so you had a problem. I even put on a, a boost. So how am I supposed to deal with that? Hmm. Now I can push him to a special two which I should have done. See, look at that. I almost evaded that, because I can evade it. But when I'm rooted, it's a little bit more difficult. Look at that, then he just starts hitting me. And I'm like, what the heck? At this point, I threw in the towel. I said, that's enough. That's enough for me, thank you. I sent in a message. I said, I've had enough. Somebody else take this uh, scorpion. I think I've had quite enough. I'm not gonna do this anymore all right so somebody else came through took him out and yeah nasty ugly war so we'll be back in a minute and you'll find out how this war ended and we're back and despite that ugly display of mine we won I was like, huh. In fact, um, when we were totaling it up later, uh, they said, don't worry about it. We got this. And I'm like, that's the only reason I'm not raging over that mess at the end. But yeah, everybody's having a, a rough time with this meta. Ugh, so ugly. Anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know how you're feeling about this meta. Take care, and you all have a blessed day.